Hello everyone, welcome to Math is Fun. Our lesson for today is all about visualizing decimal numbers using models like blocks, grids, number lines, and money to show the relationship to fractions. Look at the blocks or cubes model to visualize decimal and the relationship to fraction. Observe that there are 10 cubes representing the whole. Now let's color the 9 cubes with red. What is the fractional part of the red cubes? Alright, it is 9 tenths or 9 out of 10. How do we write 9 tenths in decimal? Yes, this is the way how we write 9 tenths in decimal. We read this as 9 tenths. Another example. There are 10 cubes representing the whole. Now let's color the 6 cubes with red. What is the fractional part of the red cubes? Alright, it is 6 tenths or 6 out of 10. And in decimal form, we write 6 tenths in this form. This is 6 tenths. Suppose that we are dividing the whole into 100 parts. Now, let's color the 25 parts with yellow. What is the fractional part of the yellow color? Yes, you are right. It is 25 hundredths or 25 out of 100. In decimal form, we write like this, 25 hundredths. Another example, we are dividing the whole into 100 parts. Now, let's color the 34 parts with yellow. What is the fractional part of the yellow color? Alright, it is 34 hundredths or 34 out of 100. In decimal form, we write like this, 34 hundredths. Now let's use the number line. Below, we're going to use the fraction form and above is the decimal form. Suppose that this number line represents one whole. Half of it is 5 tenths or in lowest term it is one half. In decimal form it is 5 tenths. How the decimals related to money? In money we have the centavos. So the decimal represents the centavos. For example, 10 centavos. So in symbol, we write like this. 10 centavos. This is 25 centavos. So in symbol, it is 25 centavos. These are the relationships between decimals and fractions. Number one, fractions and decimals are similar because they both are ways to express partial numbers. Number two, fractions can be expressed as decimals by performing the division of the ratio. Number three, decimals can also be expressed as fractions in terms of tens, hundreds, thousands, and so on. I hope that you understand our lesson for today. 
with this just because something is difficult doesn't mean you shouldn't try it just means you should try harder thank you for watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more educational videos.